Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming to subscribe. And for those who haven't, let's take just one minute of our time to hit subscribe. Apochini, is it here or here? <laughs> There's a red button, Apochini. You click once in a lifetime. Alafu tunasonga. Thank you. So, Leo, hey, Leo nataka kurusha mawe police station. Na bedha kuna kitu mtafanya. <laughs> Ama, let me say leo nataka ni wagumbanishi. Let me even stop smiling. Leo, yani kuna vile, I want to talk about the, the habits in society zenye zina ni irritate. Hmm? But the society ni nani? Society is just basically wewe unanitazama. Na mimi, we make society. Sasa kuna hii trend tumeanza, squeezy. Hata si squeezy. For a while now, we've had this habit of stigmatizing wase when you're like, they're going through stuff. Especially, Kuna hii kategori ya wase wa, wametoka kwa failed marriages. Yani ya watu tunawatomentingi tuna, tuna maze for no good reason. Like mse, amenda, ame work hard in her marriage. Like let's say ame stay pale 3 years, 5 years, 10 years of her life. Alafu imefikia point. This person ame pitia stuff. Maze, watu hupitia by the way situations mbaya mbaya sana. And they've really tried. Unakuta mse amejaribu cancelling. Amejaribu kuyombea, amejaribu kunyenyekea, amejaribu everything humanly possible to make this marriage work. Kitambo mtu ni adult na akili zake timamu, ame decide, let me just step out of this marriage, mazi ya nakuanga shafika mwisho mwisho. Let me tell you something. Wewe sasa ukiwa pale, ukianza kumjudge, you're just not being fair by the way. You're not even being realistic. Ju, can you imagine ange, ange, ange decide kubaki tu hapo ndani in that very toxic marriage, that very toxic relationship. Alafu, they don't even come out alive. Haven't you heard of situations penye spouse ameua the other partner? So, would you rather mtu akufe, akitetea Mrs. somebody ama Mr. somebody kuliko tu a step out na jaribu life tena afresh? Me by the way, salute such people because it really takes um, a, a very strong heart for somebody to step out of a marriage. Lakini society ni nani? Tusha jambia sisi ni ICC, sisi ndio siju tunajitaje high court. Hmm? Mtu tu akitoka, hmm, uya hata hizi niambia kitu. Ya hata marriage yake hiku work, so hata tuambia. Mazejo, you don't know, you are not there. Kitambua decide kutoka na ni mtu adult na kili zake zinafanya kazi. Just don't judge. Ama situation number two, unakuta mtu ni msichana, let's say kwa batimbaya amepata ball. Badala, aende a bot like, like most of them do, ya yeah, me decide, let me just be strong, let me just be courageous. I raise this kid, lakini society ni nani? He, mtoto wa fulani, akona mtoto na ajaolewa. Now that's now the topic of the street, that is now the topic of the village or whatever. Yani tunawa stigmatize, tunawa traumatize, like tunawa ongelelea as if they don't matter anymore in this life. Maze kupata mtu hii, si ati ni life sentence, ni, life, ni death sentence, no. Kupata mtu hii, you can start again. Na ukwe very, u, u achieve dreams zako na ambitions zako vizuri sana na huyo mtoto. Lakini society ni nani? By the nini ukwangambaya na sisi? Like ni nini? Uo mtoto ata hakuhusu by the the first place. Ni mtoto maybe wa jirani. Ama ni mtoto tu, anakuanga kwa hiyo mtayenyu na amipata mtu hii. Sasa wewe, kuliko umu embrace, umu encourage, um, like umsaidie kugeta logi maisha. Sisi, sasa ndo tuna maneno, maneno, left, right and center, kumsengenya, kum, kumtenga. It's just not right, bana. We need to style up, tuwache itabia ya, ya kizamani sana of stigmatizing people who are going through stuff. Na hata kuna mse, unakuta amikaka for long, hajaua ama hajaolewa. Sasa, nani alisema ati lazima hata kila mtu olewa in the first place? Maybe hata hata kiku olewa, lakini sisi ni nani? Mm, uya mesha fika 40 na aja olewa, ako 35, uya shai. Buda, uwezi jua, umse labda mepitia heartbreak ingine ya kimataifa bana. Uwezi jua, you, you're not in their life, you're not in their shoes. Kitu enya hupiti, just do not judge by the way. Sikatai, marriage is a God-given institution, and for those uh, whose marriages are working, we really have every reason to kneel down and thank God every day for 
that usichukulie for granted but hiyo haikupati mandate ya kwanza kujudge judge wa say wenye zao zime fail just thank god for yours and let's embrace wale wenye wanapitia staff bana hii maisha we need each other wewe unaweza kuko na hiyo marriage yako uko path but there's a place uta need who mtu lakini sasa si tunajionanga like sisi ndo ICC we need to judge them we need to siji condemn everybody no haikwangi poa by the way na hii life kumbuka ni safari leo anaweza kuwa ni yeye kesho ni wewe ama hata wewe huwezi pitia labda mtoto wako akuje apitie utajitetea ukiwa pande gani by the way let's just stop this to embrace yane kila mtu na weakness zake kila mtu na kitu anapitia in this life just do not judge hujui kenye alipitia kitambo make your decision ali make na huyu ni mtu mzima just respect that mimi hata na respecting sana because it really takes a strong strong heart to make such a decision so society tafadhali let us just style up tuache hiyo tabia ya kujudge judge wa see thank you so much kwa kunisikiza and uh, let's meet in our next one thank you and bye